The question says the IUPAC name of the complex. If you look at the complex, you can see it is not a neutral complex. You can see plus three charges given here. It is the cationic complex. What kind of complex? Cationic complex. And keep in mind if the central metal atom is present in the cationic complex, we use its common name as given in the periodic table. Okay. In case if the central metal atom is present in the anionic complex, we have to use its special name. Okay, so let me write the complex first of all. We have Cr chromium, then neutral ligand is there, and hole 6 is there, and overall charge for the complex is what plus 3 is there. Okay, we have the order to name the complex number of ligand, then type of the ligand, then central metal atom, then we have the oxidation number of the central metal atom to be written in the Roman numbers. Okay, so first of all, number of ligands only one type of ligand are there. How many? Six are there. So we can write it is hexa. Okay, hexa is there. Then we have ammonia is there, neutral ligand. We name it as a amine. So hexa amine is there. Hexa amine is there. Interesting. Then we have the central metal atom, common name. We can write it is chromium. It is chromium is there. Okay, now we can calculate the oxidation number. Next, what oxidation number? So, oral charge for the complex is what? Plus 3. Then, chromium is there. And then, neutral again means oral charge for the neutral again is always 0. The 6 multiplied by 0. Then, chromium is present in plus 3 oxidation numbers. Okay, we are we have 3. Okay. And now, keep in mind, it is not a neutral complex. It is cationic. Cationic. It means that we have to add in the last ion is there. Okay, we have to add ion. So name is hexaamine chromium three ion either hexaamine. Okay, you can see AA is coming two times, so we can eliminate one A. So hexaamine chromium three ion is there. We have hexaamine chromium four is there three. You can see this option either hexaamine chromium three ion is there. Option B is correct.